the land of origin and opportunity. Explore the oldest and independent country in Africa. It is situated here at Dubai Expo 2020 in Opportunity District. As we enter this pavilion, what is it called? This is Ethiopian country. As you enter Ethiopia, a glance of textile, the historical Rusi, natural resources, coffee, the crops, and the like are just welcoming. But before that, let's dive in and see exactly who is Ethiopia. Ethiopia is an African country that is situated in the horns between Djibouti, Eritrea, Kenya, Southern Sudan, and Somalia. Its main capital city is Addis Ababa, and Ethiopian bill is its main currency. Ethiopia is one of the countries that is well known due to its population in Africa, having the highest population. Ethiopian economy all depends on agricultural industry which consists of only or above 80% of its GDP. It's believed that most youth in Ethiopia are unemployed. Ethiopia deals in exportation mainly of its agricultural products, that is coffee, which is one of the best coffees in the whole world. At the same time, Ethiopia exports livestock and it imports also motor vehicles, petroleum and other things. Ethiopian pavilion makes us understand the beauty of Ethiopia as an African country. One is heritage sites. Ethiopia is the first African country with the most UNESCO World Heritage Sites. These heritage sites, they are nine in number and they range from religious to natural cultural sites. We talk about Similene National Park, Koso National Landscape, and Rock Hawin Churches. Do you know that Ethiopia has more than 80 languages in Africa. So that makes it the highest country in Africa that speak different languages. Putting English as the language that is being used for education purposes. We have languages like Somalia, Tigrinya, Amharic, and Oromo, among others. Did you know that in Africa there was the first person to win Olympic game? This person was from Ethiopia. So this Abebe Bikara was from Ethiopia, who won the marathon champion Rome Summer Olympics. That was way back 1960. He won again in Tokyo after four years. But the good, the surprising, and uh, one thing to remember about it is a baby was not putting on shoes at the time of winning this marathon. But by the time he went to Tokyo for the second marathon, he won, he was putting on shoes. Leaving that aside, did you know also that Ethiopia has never been colonized among the 54 countries in Africa? Italy tried to colonize Ethiopia. That was way back. When you hear about Ethiopia, there are a lot and very many surprising and beautiful things that one has to know. Let's see and let's explore what are these famous things that are written or unknown about Ethiopia. <laughs> Of human being, which is a complete of fossils. This is to show you 
all, all human beings belong to the Bohan family. So that is in Ethiopia, we are a couple of human beings. We brought our natural fingers, so we are here to show how Ethiopia is an ancient country. And we have different products like coffee, because we have origin of uh, Arabica coffee, wow. as Uganda is origin of Robusta coffee. This is the best coffee you've ever taken. If you, this one, the best coffee. If you take it, you need more. Ethiopia observes 13 months in a calendar, unlike other countries. This makes it seven years behind other countries in the whole world. If you are very interested to go to Ethiopia, you will find a slang of 13 months of sunshine. However, they also for a 12 month calendar. I will disturb you again. Sorry, I'm disturbing you. Just one to one. Only like this. Thanks for allowing us in your space once again. If you've not watched our videos previously, kindly watch Egypt is a historically gifted country on earth. Watch also the advantages of attending Expo 2020 Dubai. Thank you very much. See you next week. Indeed, this is the world's biggest expo here in Dubai. I'm Christine, your lady, taking you through Expo 2020 Dubai on Immaculate Show. Before we proceed Expo 2020 here in Dubai, let's highlight some things that our fans and everybody out there has been asking. For example, most people are asking about how much are the tickets? What is the cost of entering the Expo 2020? How do you travel? And who are the people who are entering the Expo 2020 free of charge? No, I'm not to see Filipino. video before 15th of October you are free to go and pick your ticket at 95 Dilham and that is a promotional ticket which is going to run for the whole month of October remember 95 Dilham is supposed to be for only one day but here is the promotion but you have to grab your ticket before 15th of October <laughs> Excuse me, everyone here, we have the time machine right? If you want to enter, we'll have to stand in queue behind oh, the queue. Then, there is another one, which is called a seasonal pass. Seasonal pass, you are going to use it for six months. And this one will cost you 495 dirham. Meaning, you will be entering the Expo 2020 site as long as you paid that money. You will enter as many times as you want. Then we have a monthly one, which is 195 dirham. 195 dirham, it is on a monthly basis and it will count from the day it is issued to you. Welcome to Egypt. 
My name is Moon. The meaning is Moon is light. I was named after the light that continues to shine over Egypt, illuminating its path to the future. Thank <laughs> you. 